Can you actually double your weight? Well, I did it and in today's video I'm gonna tell you guys how. I started at 105 pounds, which is around 47, 48 kilograms. I was looking exactly like this, so as you can see I was very tiny, very skinny. I was quite tall as well, so around 170 I believe. But I was a dancer, I used to burn a lot of calories every day, I was training a lot and I was definitely not eating as much as I was supposed to eat. Finally after I ended my dancing career I decided to start bodybuilding, I decided to make something about my anorexic physique and I started working out with weights. I made a gym membership with my friends, we started going to the gym. We didn't know much about the working out, about nutrition, actually nothing at all. So we just went inside the gym and we were doing what others were doing. So we were just trying to mimic what they were doing. We slowly started to learn more and more about working out, about the nutrition. Anyway, for me, I knew it's gonna take a long time. I knew that to take that physique, that skinny physique, to a whole nother level is gonna take years. So I was very patient and I was right about it because it took me in total around nine years to actually double my weight. So I went from 100 pounds to 200 pounds in, in about nine years. So it was roughly 12 pounds, which is five kilograms per year, which is definitely not a lot, but for me it was significant and I was really happy with my results. In the first phase, because I didn't know exactly how the nutrition works and uh, all the calories and so on, I didn't put a lot of muscle mass in the first years. But after that, I started to have better and better results. In the first, let's say, three years, it was a struggle to gain weight. I didn't know how many calories I was eating. I was definitely not eating enough. I didn't know much about nutrition at all. And then in 2014, 2015, in those years, I started to have better results because I studied more about the nutrition. I was counting my calories. I was counting my macros. I slowly realized the importance of nutrition. And with all the study and with all the information applied, then the results came. Prior to studying more about the nutrition and about calories and so on, I was just drifting around. I didn't know exactly how much I was eating. I didn't know how much I need to eat in order to progress. But with all the information that I acquired and also my studies in the University of Medicine and Pharmacy, I was studying nutrition, it helped me a lot. Talking about uh, information and knowledge, guys, if you didn't see my previous video, I dropped my new ebook. It's launched, it's out there. It has a lot of information about nutrition and not only working out, supplements, micronutrients, macronutrients, setbacks, consistency and so on, alcohol, everything is included in this ebook. If you're confused and you don't know where to start, if you don't know where to search for the information, I suggest you to start with this book. It has everything planned for you and it's also backed up by science. I have more than 30 studies and it's also very easy to understand. So check it out here guys. You will hear me talking a lot about the nutrition in this video because it was crucial for me to start making progress. I was training, I started to understand better the, the workout aspect, but the nutrition for me, it was confusing. So I will talk more about the nutrition. A good trick that was very useful for me and my best friend, what we were doing, we started betting with each other. So for example, we were setting a date and by that date, we are supposed to gain that amount of weight. So I give you an example. Let's say that in three months, we were supposed to go from 60 kilos to 63 kilos or 65 kilos. So that was the goal. So we were batting against each other. So we were pushing each other. Also, we were training together. So it was a nice, uh, let's say, rivalry. 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 It was a good kind of a rivalry be in between us, but it really helped a lot. And we started to make more and more progress. We had many situations in which we didn't feel like eating, we didn't want to eat, we couldn't eat anymore, so we were just forcing the meals, forcing the calories. Guys, it's part of the game. In order to double your weight, in order to put that amount of weight, you have to force the meals. You have to, to try to not skip any meals and have all the calories that you're supposed to have. In order to do so, I was always cooking in bulk. I was always preparing in advance. Whenever I was, and I'm still doing the same thing right now, whenever I see that, my food, it's like on the last resort, the last part, and I have to buy again. I do my groceries, I cook in bulk, everything is in the, the fridge, you know, packed, and uh, nutrition is my number one priority. Even right now, it's, it's gonna be always number one priority. We also obviously use supplements like proteins and creatine, so these ones help a lot when it's hard to, to take the solid meals. We were doing like shakes, you know, like a 
scoop of protein, uh, some banana, uh, peanut butter and uh, you know creatine, everything there is easier to, to take the calories this way. Moving on from the nutrition, we talked a lot obviously because in order to grow you have to, to eat, you have to give your body enough nutrients, but you have to stimulate the body in order to create growth. Throughout the years I started to learn how to work out properly, to have a good execution, a proper form. I realized the importance of a high intensity, full range of motion, slow tempo, constant tension on the muscle. These things were very important and they're also inside my book. And slowly I started to make progress, I started to increase the weight more and more, I started to become stronger. Obviously with the workouts it was the same scenario with my best friend when we were training together, we were pushing each other, we were correcting each other. This was also very important because from the outside you see it a little bit different. If you're lucky enough to have a friend, a training partner, that's amazing because you can correct each other. On top of a good technique, workout technique, executing it for years with a good nutrition, we realized that it's gonna take time, it's not gonna happen overnight. Therefore, I was very patient. So, like I said in the beginning, I knew it's gonna take a long time. I started in 2010, I was at 105 pounds. Currently, after almost 14 years, I'm at around 86 kilograms, which I believe is like 190. I'm bulking again, probably for the last time. I'm gonna have a big bulk. So again, I'm putting into practice the same technique, the same thing that I was telling you about. So the nutrition is on point, I'm counting my calories, I know exactly how many macros I have, the workouts are intense. So I'm still practicing the same things, the same idea. This sport, it's quite boring, it's nothing entertaining, but it's all worth it. One crucial thing that I did throughout these entire years, I never stopped learning. I always tried to improve myself, I always tried to search for more, to search for more information, to gather more, to learn from others that are much more experienced than me, that know much more than me. Guys, if you decide to start this journey, this bodybuilding journey, and you want to improve, you want to get bigger, I'm telling you, it is possible. I doubled my weight, so it is possible. Going from this anorexic kid to this physique right here, I'm pretty sure you can do it as well. I'm a natural bodybuilder, so it's possible in natural way as well. If you want to see other videos regarding the nutrition, you have them up there as well as workout videos in which you can see my technique and my intensity. Actually, in my previous video, it was a very heavy, hard leg workout, so you can check it out. If this video helped, hit those like and subscribe buttons. Down in the description, you have the link to acquire my book. I'm sure that you will find a lot of useful information in it. Thanks again for watching, guys, and see you next time. Ciao.